How's it going everybody? It's Pride here and today I'm bringing you guys another video. This one is not going to be too long. I just want to talk a little bit about this specific topic which you guys might have seen about, might have read about recently. I'm um, just getting around to it now. It's in regards to Poise in Dark Souls 3. So if you guys remember a couple of months ago, there was somebody from Kotaku, I believe, who emailed somebody at Bandai Namco and those people at Bandai Namco ended up passing on the questions to the people over at From Software. And the questions are basically regarding Poise and how Poise is basically non-existent in Dark Souls 3, has no real purpose, is it turned off? And that's what everybody was speculating that Dark Souls 3 just had the Poise system just completely turned off. Uh, but the people from at From Software actually replied saying it is working as intended. The poise system in Dark Souls 3 is working as intended by not working at all. There was no poise real no there was no real poise in Dark Souls 3. Um, there was no real reason for it. There was no real reason to use very heavy armor, just nothing, you know? So obviously most people are like uh, okay, working as intended, meaning it wasn't supposed to work from the beginning, I guess. But recently, just a couple of days ago, uh, maybe the same people or maybe the same guy actually got the chance to email Hidetaka Miyazaki himself, the game director of Dark Souls 3, Dark Souls 1, Bloodborne, you know, some of the games that people really enjoy. So he asked him a series of questions, but I'm pretty sure they're going to have more about that and more about those questions later on in the week. So keep an eye on Kotaku, man. They're probably going to have some good stuff, maybe even about future DLCs and stuff like that. So I'm very excited to see what comes later on this week. But one of the questions that was asked was about the lack of communication regarding poise in Dark Souls 3. Specifically, what he says in the article says, and I asked him about his studio's lack of communication regarding poise. Now, I want you to keep that in mind. I want you to keep that specific wording in mind after you hear the reply. Uh, basically, the, rep the reply was, This isn't something we are particularly proud of, said Miyazaki. With how things are handled now, it can be improved, and this is an agenda item we'll be working on in the future. Now, that is definitely a very interesting reply and the reason I said in the beginning is to keep in mind the way the actual email of the guy was worded or at least what he said in the article which was I thought you got or sorry I read the wrong part he said I asked him about his studio's lack of communications regarding poise now if this would have just said oh we emailed him regarding the stat poise in Dark Souls 3 something like that and that was the reply that they came back with I would have been like Holy shit, you know, maybe in the future we might see a specific change to poise, maybe improving it, maybe adding poise at all, at least a little bit into Dark Souls 3, then I would have been excited. But that specific wording of the first line, basically the reply is talking about the communications and the way they communicate with the audience and with the people who buy their games maybe stuff for updates, stuff like that. It seems like that is what they're replying to more than the actual poise system in Dark Souls 3 because they did handle it very badly. When they got asked about poise, uh, basically people know there's almost no poise in Dark Souls 3 and they said it's just working as intended. That's it. Peace. And then that was it. You know, we didn't get, oh, this is exactly how it's working. This is what poise does in Dark Souls 3. No, we just got a reply saying it's working as intended. And nobody uh, really knows what that means. We're just left to guess what that means for ourselves. But I definitely think that this reply basically was them saying that in the future, they're going to try to do better with communicating with their audience. They're going to do better to try to actually say what they do for maybe updates and stuff like that and maybe not be as vague as they usually are with stuff from their updates because if you have ever read the patch notes for their updates it's usually left to the fans to decide and actually notice what they changed usually change efficiency to this weapon and then that's it uh, but definitely it's kind of uh, ironic considering how vague this reply itself is. Uh, but for those people who might have gotten their hopes up a bit that Poise may be coming back to Dark Souls 3 because of this reply in this specific email, um, I wouldn't. I wouldn't say it's 100% that it's not ever going to happen, but it's probably like 98, 99. Uh, but like I said... That is, uh, that's the video I wanted to make for today. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Definitely, definitely let me know what you guys think in the comments. And I'll talk to you guys later. Peace, everybody.